smack dab in the middle of the wasteland. Well, it's got a nice smell. This is terrible. I cannot live here. I have to go now. Okay, location perfect. The locker? No. We'll see. Okay, okay all right, settle down, settle down. So what, so you can call me a shrew or a hag or some freaky, shrieky, demanding witch? I didn't mean it! Austin, why? Why would you do something so horrible? You know what? I have no idea how to please you. You tell me to work a miracle, then you're mad at me for doing it. What do you want? From you? Nothing, ever! Ellie, hon, I thought vampires couldn't go out in the sun. Uh... Nice to know someone in your family has a sense of humor, Emma. She's totally pretty. We really connected. I mean, Caitlin and I have so much in common. Wow, I guess she really did feel sorry for you. Let me guess, your latest expose. How could he? So then bring someone, whatever. Um, Hannah, I don't think anyone got it. Um, this song, it has lyrics. <laughs> well, what did you expect? For he's a jolly good fellow? More work? It's a comprehension assignment. This car means more to you than I do. It's only at a quarter. Yeah, me too, but getting all down and sucky doesn't help anyone. Okay. Um, I'm sorry you had a crappy year. I'm sorry Craig treated you like dirt, but get over it. Paige, you have no idea. You take everything so seriously. Just lighten up. You should. I'm sorry to be brutally blunt, but Craig didn't cheat on you just because of hormones. But it won't help. Because the real problem is you. <sighs> Maybe because you're wearing a sari. You were supposed to ask for a kurta, what Indian men wear.